Somebody commented on my video. Um, somebody commented on my video uh, today, being the the Our Lady of Knock. Um, did I was I referencing my video to today's reading in the mass? I sadly today I I didn't I'm not a, I didn't able to go to mass. I have to work and uh, during the week and our mass times and my work time don't meet. And they said you should read the first reading from today because whether you knew it or not maybe the holy spirit was saying something you and it's about today is our lady of knock uh you know when the lamb of god appeared the lamb of god appeared people think always looking at her lady the lamb of god our lady's beside her son the center of that apparition is the lamb of god listen to what was in today's reading a day after what they published in knock remember knock yesterday what they did. What did our Lord's message come today on Our Lady of Knock? Listen to this. This is powerful. This is powerful. Son of man, prophecy against the shepherds of, of Israel. Prophe prophecy and say to them, shepherds, the Lord says, trouble for the shepherds of Israel who feed themselves. Shepherds ought to feed their flock. Yet they have fed on milk. They have dressed themselves in wool. You have sacrificed the fattest sheep. You have failed to feed the flock. You have failed to make weak sheep strong and to care for the sick ones or bandaged the wounded ones. You have failed to bring strays and to look for the loss. On the contrary, you have ruled with cruelly, ruled them cruelly and violently. For lack of a shepherd, they have scattered. They have become prey of, of any wild animal. They have scattered far. My flock is straying this way and that, on mountains and on high hills. My flock has been scattered all over the country. No one bothers about them and no one looks for them. Well then, shepherds, hear the word of the Lord. As I live... I swear it, it is the Lord who speaks. Since my flock has been looted for lack of a shepherd, it is now the prey of any wild animal. Since my shepherds have stopped bothering about my flock, since my shepherds fed themselves rather than my flock, flock in view of all this, shepherds, hear the word of the Lord. The Lord says this, I am going to call the shepherds to account. I am going to take my flock back from them and I shall not allow them feed my flock. It is this way the shepherds will stop feeding themselves. I shall rescue my sheep from their mouths. They will not prey on them anymore. So, uh, quite, I mean, today is Our Lady of Knock quite prophetic that reading that we hear today the day after Enoch when they came out with that great synodal synthesis yes we're the new this is the new church married priests and women priests and married deacons and and, and, and LGBT this and in 10 years time it'll be trans deacons and trans priests and because that's what's happened in the church in the Anglican church and why can't gay priests get married now to gay well like real should we just make it up whatever we like like really does i mean does this thing called the holy bible do you know anyone heard of it do, i mean i suppose we just retranslate the new testament you know just what christ asks us to do people might think i'm being stupid here but i'm asking the question isn't it prophetic what was said today on a lady of knock the day after what they did in Knock. What they did. We know better. Our look uh, the scientific developments and human understandings. We know better than our Lord Jesus Christ. We know better than 2,000 years of teaching. Yes, the church taught one thing for 2,000 years, but we know better now. And we're going off in this synodal process now because we know better than what this thing was teaching. No, no, that. That, that's old we need we need a new one of these now please for the church 
<laughs> anyway, anyway, thanks for, for, for whoever posted me the reading. Uh, no, I hadn't connected that reading in Not Today with um, my video that I just published. I hadn't, I didn't, I hadn't made that. But uh, it's, it's, it's just amazing on Our Lady of Knock that we have that reading. Um, and the, the responsorial psalm is the Lord is my shepherd. Shepherd. And the gospel, um, Jesus said to his disciples, now the kingdom, the kingdom of heaven is near, is, sorry, the kingdom of heaven is like a land or going out at daybreak to hire workers in the vineyard. He made an agreement with the workers for one denarius a day and sent them out to the vineyard. Going out at about the third hour, he saw others standing idle in the marketplace and said to them, come, you go to the vineyard to and give and I will give you a fair wage so they went and at the sixth hour again he went out and at the ninth hour he went out and did the same and at, then and about the eleventh hour he went out and found some more standing around and said to them why have you been standing here idle all day because no one has hired us they answered and he said to them go into my vineyard too in the evening, the owner of the vineyard said to the bailiff, call all the workers and pay them their wages, starting with the latest arrivals and ending with the first. So they, so those who were hired at the 11th hour came forward and received one denarius each. When the first came, they expected to get more, but they too received one denarius each. He took it, but grumbled to the landowner. The men who came last, he said, have done only one hour work you have, you have treated them the same as us though we have done a heavy day's work all in the heat he answered one of them and said my friend i am not unjust to you did you not agree to one denarius taking your earnings and go i chose to pay you the la the last comer as i as much as i pay you have i no right to do what i like with my own why be so envious because I'm generous. Thus the first, just the last shall be first and the first shall be last. Anyway, <laughs> I love today's readings. Um, yeah, I, and uh, yeah, thanks for saying, um, I, I, I really do think the Holy Spirit is working, you know, in Ireland, I really do. And um, that reading, the reading on the shepherds, today's first reading uh, from the prophet Ezekiel, I think priests and bishops and those who are supposed to teach the faith should remember that. You know, we have to, people that are at different stages of their life, we have to give them the reward of heaven. We have to bring them to heaven. So, uh, yeah, it's quite amazing. Um, it's quite amazing. You know, I don't, I don't believe in coincidences. I think our Lord gave a message in that reading today on Our Lady of Knock two shepherds what they should be doing no you forgot the flock you didn't teach you didn't shepherd you certainly didn't do with the lockdown close shop how many countries around the world polish bishops didn't abandon their flock they kept churches opened they kept saying masses never closed sweden bishops didn't do it either not a lot of places kept shepherded you know if you can if you can shepherd then shepherd teach the faith with passion with love with sincerity anyway god bless take care bye bye